in an unpredictable world where everyone strives to be extravagant. Two men dare to be average. Either Ain't nobody way. gonna hate on us. Either way, that's it's fine. It's so fuck em. <laughs> I was gonna say a lot of people probably hate on us. That's cool. Why expect the best when you can settle for the rest? Adam McElroy. Hate the phrase Mercury retrograde. Ryan Baker. I mean, now, dogs walk around, you can see their penis. It's the Average AF Podcast. The Average AF Podcast can be listened to on all major streaming services. I'm talking really fast right now because that's what they do in movie trailers. Please drink responsibly. Blah, 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 blah. Anytime what? Spit it out, Linda. All right, are we going? We're you in. Fucking Karen. So I don't know. anytime, any dude, we're in. Welcome, yay! <laughs> anytime anybody says what what, the only thing I can think of is in the butt. What what in the butt? And I will never <laughs> ever stop thinking that. It's probably because you wanted it in the butt. No, it's from that viral whatever. <laughs> yeah, it's from video. Tosh point oh or whatever. Actually, I, Tosh I, I, first I'd heard it was on South Park. Oh. They do a whole episode about like, um, what do they call it? Like, oh, the all the viral people, and they all talk about theoretical. I'm a theoretical millionaire. I right. have so many like downloads right. and likes. No, I think the first thing is like it's a real video that they did on Tosh Point Oh. Or yeah, yeah, yeah. It was a real video. It was on. I don't know what. It, what oh, right. But you're just saying you found e-bombs. out on South Park. Yeah, e yeah, bombs or whatever. They, they recreate the whole, the entire video with butters. Time out. How the fuck are you on the speedway app <laughs> in our on, in the I while we record? That's fine. dude. You're in. No, look. That's okay. My home screen. I hit my okay. messages to look at something real okay. quick. Okay. But damn, Calm I just down, looked killer. over and it said speedway. Because I got a big ass disrespect, on my home screen. The amount of disrespect I fucking felt. Listen, look at my bag. Dude. That's why. Look. Yeah, you come home or come home. Come, come home. home. <laughs> it's my secondary home. Right. You come here bearing. With my Speedway bag. So my Speedway treats. card on one of my home screens on my phone. That's how often you so buy I, candy. Boop, boop, boop. Bah, Dude, that's what I'm saying. That shit. That's how often he buys candy. Is you have Speedway. On your home screen. Yo, I got mad and points, And it's not bro. even the Speedway just app. It's the Speedway widget. Yeah, it's a card, that, bro. That way you can scan it right away. Because I don't have the fucking physical card. God damn. <laughs> I don't yeah, have I it. You know you too. can type in your phone number and it works too. Yeah, do that when I pay for gas. I don't go inside. Pay for my card. I use that shit outside. I'm very mad at you. Why? Well, welcome to the episode. Don't be a hater. That's using technology at its finest No, right there. okay. So listen. Welcome to the episode. What? Listen. <laughs> I put my life on the line. For this content today. You Did ready you? for this? Yeah. You ready for this? I'm always ready for it. I got in it, an everybody. HSC today. Yeah, you got into high social club? <laughs> <laughs> Holy I sit. Try again. Right. Comedy? Uh, good job, Seinfeld. Um, high school comedy? <laughs> no. That was a good one. That was a good one. I got... Well, this is a different scenario than the first time. Harry Scary Carrie. <laughs> I appreciate that guess. I got Holy it. shit, Cletus! <laughs> wow, uh, I got in a high speed chase today. Yeah, with oh, who? Nice. Yeah, with the five zero. With no, that was last time. Or as Caden would say, the popos. This time <laughs> I was playing popo, and I was chasing somebody. Well, well, you were, why did were they you, disrespect you? Why are no. you trying to make a uh, civilian arrest? It was arrest? very intriguing. <laughs> You ready for this? Yeah, let's do it. So I pulled up. I pulled up to a stop sign, right? Just out in the middle of nowhere, basically. Pulled up to a stop sign. And stopped. There was somebody in front of me, whatever. <clears throat> and I just look up while they're pulling off, while they're turning. Mm-hmm. And I look at I look at the license plate, and it says, Dr. Gooch. <laughs> <laughs> well, and I immediately was like, I need a picture of this. <laughs> And I fucking chased him down. I immediately went that way, which I was going to go the other way. Went yeah. that way. And then, dude, this road was 45 mile an hour. And I'm like, why the fuck can I not catch up with this dude? And he's going like 75 mile an hour oh my God. in this 45. Yeah. And I'm like, I'm fucking committed. He's a doctor. So I'm like <laughs> right behind him. You can't give me a ticket, officer. I'm a doctor. Yeah, Dude. first off, he's either going to hook somebody up with something and get out of the ticket. I mean, come on now. Or 
He has fucking buku money Dude. to where he could just pay for well, the ticket. Well, but like it wasn't even like it was an okay car, but I forget what it was. It was like a, he's paid for a lot of tickets in his lifetime. It's a Ford. What's like the Ford version of like the Cherokee type thing? Ford Escape. That's what it was. Sure, it was a Ford Escape. Like it pricey. Yeah, I mean it's okay, <laughs> but it wasn't like a new one or anything like that. So whatever, but I'm chasing this dude. I wouldn't think that Dr. Gooch would be driving an escape. Yeah, right. <laughs> Actually, that's ironic because escape. I didn't even think of that till just now. And I'm chasing this dude, and I'm talking shit right behind him like, you motherfucker, like, I got to get this picture. Like, all this stuff. And I know fucking Dr. Gooch is looking in the mirror like this, being is- like, I'm going 30 over the speed limit. And this dude is still and trying to catch up. And this guy is still like... And I couldn't really catch up that much, like, because I was hitting, like, 75, and I was like, should I go 80? Like, come on, you I know? I mean, if you're already at wow. 75. I know, but it was risky. I didn't know where we were going. Like, I usually don't go this, this way. way. Yeah. 21 is reckless up. You're yeah. 21 over. Bro, you were already pushing 30, so yeah. what's yeah. 40? What's 50? Yeah, damn. You're still going to get I a reckless. If I could turn back time, yeah. you know? <laughs> or if you were just like me and gotten pulled over numerous times for speed well, or dumb yeah. shit. Mm. So I'm fucking tracking this dude down, right? And I'm just, at this point, I'm like, I'm hitting 75. I don't want to go that much faster. And he's far enough away that I can't get a picture. Like, you just mm. you wouldn't be able to read it right. and everything. So I'm like, we got to go until he turns mm. or there's a stop sign or something like that. And he, he turned onto this road. So now I'm like rear ending him like almost like super fucking close. Holy crap. Trying to get as close as I can while we both turn. <laughs> and then he fucking speeds off again. And I'm like, you motherfucker. And I could not fucking catch this dude. Dude, he thought it was the loan sharks were after him. Dude, I yeah. could not catch. Dude. Loan sharks are always after Dr. Gooch. They yeah, dude, have be, they right? have to be with that kind of name. <laughs> But, uh, dude, and we're going. We're still going. Now, this is a back road, and I definitely don't know where I am. (laughs) And I'm I'm pretty sure he just turned down this road to be like... Are you in town, or are you... Dude, I'm that way. I have no idea where I am. (laughs) He go. Yeah, I have no idea where I am. I had the day off, Sounds like a very upper Sandusky type. Dr. Gooch lives I don't know. (laughs) We might have been heading that direction. I have no idea. But, uh, so we're going, and like... I'm I'm still on it. Like this whole thing is probably like 15 minutes. Yeah, which is a long time for somebody to be going also 30 mile an hour over the speed limit. Agreed. And it's not like it's not like I was like riding his ass or whatever, and then he sped up to like be like, "Hey, fuck you." He was already like going. He was already this cruising. Fast. Yeah, and I'm just like, "Yeah, we're cruising." That's gouge. No, is G O O C H. Yeah, and we're going, we're going. There's finally a stop sign. I'm looking it up. Dr. Finally Gooch. a stop sign. Doctor. <laughs> there uh-huh. you go, dude, right here. Hey, there he Dr. is. Dr. Christopher Gooch. Christopher so M. Even, Gooch. Now even fucking creepier. Let's just Google his ass. There is also a Mark Gooch in Cincinnati. <laughs> Shout out to the Gooches. Oh, yeah. Mark um, Gooch is in uh, West Virginia. Okay. Steubenville. Maybe we were over in that direction. Maybe. I have no idea. More places. What is the craziest thing? Well, go down there. One of them is a fucking eye center. Kevin talking Gooch. about some laser eye surgery. Mark, Maybe okay. that's why Kevin you're trying Gooch. to hunt him down. Mark Gooch. Jesus. Yeah, dude. Matt I just Gooch. I just wanted to schedule an appointment, dude. There's Hubert a lot. Gooch. <laughs> There's Hubie a lot of Gooch. Gooch. There's a lot of Gooch. Dude, Hubie Gooch. <laughs> oh, man. I want Hubie Gooch as my doctor. Let's see what he's anyway, so there he is. We, we finally get to... Oh, dude, that's the dude right there. <laughs> yeah. That's my guy. He definitely looks like a Hubie. Fuck yeah, he would definitely try to outrun dude, somebody. Yeah, I bet he you would. Huey, and Huey dude, Gooch rocks Gucci. Yeah, if so you, if you caught him, then it would just be, <laughs> dude. So I'm still like chasing, dude. Right, and we finally get to a stop sign, and I fucking finally got it. Hey, you got the picture? Sorry, we're reading reviews on Doctor Gooch. That poor Look middle lady. That poor middle lady I left in it. tears. Oh, there's Doctor Gooch. I got the picture. Let me see it. I've been trying to show you guys. That's like, a Subaru, you dork. I know. Yeah. Shut up. Right? Dude, right Definitely when, not a Ford. Right when I opened it back up, I was like, that's a Subaru. Fuck. <laughs> but the picture actually goes over here. Yeah. And I was like, 
it clearly says Subaru. Yeah. So maybe if I zoom in, so, maybe so, they won't recognize the logo. I'm putting, but it's definitely a Subaru. I'm putting myself in, in, in Dr. Gooch's shoes here. Dude, shout out to the Gooch man. Like, so first for off, real. <laughs> I got this fucking car that's trying to catch up to Dude, me. It is so old. I'm already in like escape mode, right? Because I got this fucking creeper behind me. Yeah. And now, now I'm wait. trying to take this turn. Hold on. I'm okay. trying to take this turn as okay. I'm cruising 35 over the fucking speed limit yeah. getting away from this guy. And I'm riding his ass into and the corner trying to, with my phone out. <laughs> That's like. what I'm saying. That's what I was getting at. So then, then I'm coming around and I look at my rear view while I'm taking this fucking turn and the fucking creeper behind me is not only just following me, but he's back here in his fucking <laughs> dashboard hey, like this. hey. Hey, hey! Let me get a picture, you Gooch. Are, you remember a couple days ago when I said, or a couple weeks ago when I was amateur paparazzi? Yeah, oh, professional yeah, paparazzi, that. son. That, yeah, that was dedication. I got it this week. I don't know about pro, but we'll definitely go hey, from uh, amateur effective. to a effective, not amateur. Get shit done. Not amateur. Risk taker. Next step up. Sacrifice from amateur. for these pictures, bro. Oh, let's talk about some important stuff. So that was my afternoon. Let's <laughs> talk about sex. Man. <laughs> yeah, I don't know. I just had to get into Dr. that right Gooch. away. Yeah, that's you call freaking Dr. hilarious. Well, Dr. Gooch, like, that sounds more to me like Dr. Gooch drives a Firebird and has a jean jacket and a mullet. Is Dude. How I've been Back in the day. Dr. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> oh, man. That's a, that's a 1975 Dr. Gooch right oh, there. Oh, yeah. definitely. That's, yeah. that's a Goochster that's been a doctor for 55 years. That's an OG Gooch. Yeah, that that's Papa Gooch. <laughs> Papa that's Gooch? That's who that is. That's Papa Gooch, Doc. That's Gooch Master G right there. Right. <laughs> okay. So, Fucking Papa Gooch. Gooch. Yeah. Oh, man. I, I should have named Ryder Gooch. Dude, I was actually... Okay, so... Fine. You like that one? I No. <laughs> I've talked for a long fucking time, so now it's your turn. You did talk for a long ass to time. To tell the story. You know, that means you have to eat some candy or whatever while he's talking. Right. Chew right in on the microphone. <laughs> nom, 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 But nom, uh, nom, nom. Yeah, so your dog has a middle name. <laughs> yeah, so, you know, I'm a funny guy. <laughs> Debatable. <laughs> yeah. So, I like Dude, that. Dude, it, it seems like, for real, it seems like our audience, half of the audience loves me, hates you. Half of the audience hates me, loves you. Yeah, like 50, it's 50. Just, yeah, it's so great. Yeah, but everybody what, what deep down loves about me. me and Tim? Probably, <laughs> they all love you. You don't want to know. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> don't tell them. I know. They all love you guys. <laughs> so, what about your dog? <laughs> um, so Ryder has by far the best middle name that any dog can ever have. I will say it's up there. It is. Mm. It is up there. So. I didn't believe him at first. Yes, but it's legit, and my son made it legit by actually saying it a couple of times, and I said, well, shit, it has stuck now. <laughs> so it is Ryder, Dyson, Baker. Ryder, Dyson, Baker? Yeah. Yeah. Do you understand it? Do you know why it's Dyson? Because I didn't catch it either. Is, is it because he eats stuff off the floor like a vacuum? That's kind of what I was thinking, too. Because oh. he's my Ryder, Dyson. Yeah. That's pretty funny. Dude. <laughs> that's but that's his legitimate middle name. Yeah, and I was like, I don't name. believe you. Yeah. <laughs> and like, so the other day we were out, like when this first happened, because I, I joked about it at oh, first. Oh, this is recent? Well, I, I mean, like probably within like the last two weeks. Okay. Well. Yeah. So recent That's recent. Yeah. yeah. Okay. <laughs> so now, okay. I thought the whole time you were like. Oh, no, no. Yeah. No. So I was like joking about it when All we right. first got him. And I was like. What if I just named him Dyson? And I was thinking in my head, and I'm like, Ryder Dyson. Like, he's my Ryder Dyson. I was like, I'm sticking with it. Like, I think yeah. that would be dope. And Danielle, like, I ran it by her. She didn't really get it at first. And I was like, <laughs> Nobody right. gets Nobody it at would. first. Yeah. That's my point. Yeah. So, but then when you explain it, it's so fucking good. It yeah. is. And, that's, and it's th upsetting. that's the other thing, because I was like, well, because a lot of people, nobody will know what it means. Right. So then... We were joking about it and everything. Well, Ryder was outside doing something he wasn't supposed to, like getting into the, the tree or some shit like that. Right. All of a sudden, because I'm inside in the mud room, and I hear go Caden go, Ryder Dyson. <laughs> <laughs> and I go, it's Dyson. <laughs> right, yeah, there it is. <laughs> so that's my Ryder Dyson right there. Did you tell him about it? Huh? Did you tell Caden about it? No, he just heard me and Danielle talking about it. Oh, okay. okay like that I was going to name him Dyson. Okay. And I just like we kept kind of talking about it, so I think he just heard okay. it. That's awesome, though. Yeah. Normally, yeah. shit like that, you hear and it like sounds like it makes sense, but then when you like dissect it, you're like, that doesn't make fucking sense. Yeah. 
But this one, it sounds like, the fuck are you talking about? But then when you explain it, it gets so much cooler. Yeah, you're like, it's oh, like shit, the that's opposite. Dope. Yeah. That's dope. Yeah, it's yeah. pretty cool. You got that with me. Was that, that was just yesterday, right? Yeah. Yeah. Bastard. So, um, that's a good one. It's perfect. I love it. I yeah. love it. And he actually listens very well to it. Okay. He's Good almost like a freaking human. Well, you know how you hit him with like the first name human. and they don't really listen, and then you're like the first and middle name, mm-hmm. and then it's the first, middle, and last name? Right. You hit him with that shit, game dude, over. and he like literally will look at you like, uh, come right in. I'm see, like, I don't, Damn, I don't have sorry, that. Bro. I don't have that problem. Like, you can literally just look at Harper the wrong way, and she'll have a breakdown. Yeah. She's so sensitive. Yeah. It's hilarious a little bit because she's like <laughs> you know she's three doesn't really i almost said something but i might have lost half my half of what? audience okay <laughs> but uh <laughs> now no, there's just the head that, that just hates you dude, hates you <laughs> yeah so i don't know i don't know why i was thinking well actually i do know why i was thinking about this <laughs> why because so, your name's I, lance dude that's not going to be in the episode. <laughs> what? The the part before oh. that we talked about, but yeah. that's Man. hilarious. But Patreon. Lance isn't even a popular name anymore. It's definitely not. I know somebody named Sir Lance a lot. Who? That's actually his real name. There's that's... a couple people that's going to listen to this and know because he's a real guy. He is a real and guy. And they definitely, the two people I'm thinking of, pretty much listen every week. So I'm probably going to get a message like, hey, shout out Sir Lance a lot. Because that's a real person. That is a real person. But that's all I can say about that. But. (laughs) Yeah, that shit's not even popular, though. Just Lance. Like the medieval times, it was Lance. In the medieval times, they were named Lance a lot. Here it comes. Right. (laughs) That's. I know. You didn't. I didn't. I didn't fucking expect you to have a friend named (laughs) Sir Lance a lot. She's going to be so mad. Dude. You dropped. You're. You're. Dropping the ball again. You got. <laughs> oh, I can't help it on that one. I would and just power through or sneak it in better. Dude, it's. Then he hits me with Sir Lance a lot. <laughs> Fuck you, dude. I, I fucking, can't. I fucking Sir Lance lotted right into the middle of I'm your sorry, joke, Jackie. dude. Fuck Adam. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I'm sorry. I just have great things no, to say. No, you just need to step your game up. Oh, there we go. That's kind of what it is. You're right. I took it from. I took it from, you know, doing it on my podcast to making it a real fucking life by naming it Ryder Tyson <laughs> Baker. <laughs> Jesus. Team Baker, baby. So what I was going to say, though. Oh, Life- my God. Lifetime member. <laughs> I, I was right. This episode's fucking insane. Happy New Year, um, bitch. Yeah, Happy New Year, guys. It's yeah, 2020. Year. It That's, is going to be when they watch this. Yeah. Uh, it's New Year's Eve right now for us. New Year's Rockin' Eve. Trademark. Sure. That's right. <laughs> Trademark. <laughs> We dude with the fucking quickness though. again though again just like last week very festive you know New Year's Eve vibes all throughout the Ba-da! the studio look at the tree yeah <laughs> you know, look at like, the tree it's uh you know we do what we can this is a, a high production yeah. type show hey this Vaughn is the only, with, uh, that's all that matters that's the only the decor budget. we need <laughs> yeah, right. Yeah, shout out Vaughn, too. Um, Always shout so out So this Vaughn. whole time, what I was trying to get to... Shout out Vaughn. I felt left out, and I felt like a dick by not saying anything. So well, it's okay. Now you're just a follower, dude. And now you're a flow ruiner. But make sure you are a <laughs> follower by following Vaughn <laughs> everywhere. Whoop, whoop. That's, and not uh, Adam. That's Vaughn professional did. shit. Um, <laughs> so, hey, hey. Oh, my God, hey, what? Hey, did you see Facebook? What yeah. about Did me? you see what I did? I yeah, I did. <laughs> I did. I did. What? Dude. Mark that shit down first time 2021, baby. Dude. <laughs> yeah, dude. Yeah. On Christmas Eve. Post. Yeah, dude. That was great. That was epic. You like that? Yeah, Shared I did, it, dude. Did it the right way. It got Fuck a lot yeah. of it got a lot of engagement. Yeah, see, I got don't Got quite just... a bit of views, a couple subscribers off of that shit right there. That's what I'm talking about. You know yeah, why? Yeah, shout out to the newbies. What yeah, up? Yeah, shout out. That's because it's marketing, boy. Yeah, marketing dude. 101. This, I, I learned some shit. Yeah, so, okay, good job for did your first post. time. Thanks. Yeah. <laughs> and it did wonder. Look, first time, got a couple subscribers. Thank you guys if you're watching. Don't worry, I'm much better than Adam. Okay, yeah, probably. But the first, uh, yeah, your first <laughs> post about it was episode 126, dude. <laughs> better late than never. That's right. Hey. I like it. I like that energy. But speaking about posting, dude, we were talking about like kind of our kids and stuff. No. Stop it. (laughs) (laughs) You said posting. Uh, 
<laughs> but like all the all the the presents that you see like online where people are like giving fake gifts to like their kids and shit. Typically, you see that gifts. shit. Dude, yeah. usually you'll see it like with the PS5s or yeah. the new Xboxes. Oh, where they like, give like it to the, in a box and then it's something else. Right. Yeah, you, like it's like you're just really shitty shitty parents. Dude, I know. I, dude, that's what I wanted to say. Like, yeah. I feel so bad. Like, that's, I mean, like I'm thinking, it, I'm thinking in the back of my me. head when they do that shit. Like, you better have that fucking PS5 hooked up in their bedroom. Right. Like, like you now though, better <laughs> have that shit somewhere. Yeah, dude. I mean, yeah. If you if you pull the wool over their eyes like that, and you're like, yeah, it's, well, you just give them like a lump of coal in that box or something. Right. But yeah. Then, you know, they turn around and you got it sitting there. Right. That's cool. I'm I'm okay with that. It's yeah. Funny. If but you got like a 10 second window, like to yeah. where you're like. Oh man! Yeah, you can get the video yeah. of the quick By reaction. The way, yeah, you got yeah. ten seconds to do that, or welcome to therapy. Right, and then Dude, you better have when yeah. I was thirteen. Yeah, you better have that fucking person cued to come through that hallway. <laughs> right. Hey, hey so, calm down. But yeah, dude, like, <laughs> like everybody, you know, holidays now. You're seeing all that shit like constantly, and every time I'm like, you are fucking up your kid. Like, yeah, don't man. do that shit. Yeah. Hands down, like. I, I like to do something like my my nephew's seventeen, and I got him a gift card for like an Xbox Live or the you know whatever marketplace whatever the hell you get it right okay. So I got him that, but I wrapped it and then I covered it in zip ties and made sure that you couldn't see the code even if you got the wrapping paper. On. <laughs> oh man! So he had to like cut the zip ties and get all the duct tape off before he could right. use it. See that shit's fun. I, I thought that was funny because yeah. there was nothing wrong. It was right. still a card. He could still use it. Yeah. The right yeah. problem. But a little just, bit of effort for like to get into you it. know some money just, or whatever. Like because yeah. that's all he wanted was a gift card. I'm like because I I like to try to go beyond and get my nieces and nephews like a cool present they wouldn't think of or right. something like that. And he Do just he was very different. adamant. He's like I want this gift card. This was like a couple of years ago. Right. I'm like fine. I'll get it for you. And I'm right. like, you're gonna work for it. So did did you guys ever have like an experience where you kind of thought you were getting something, but ended up not getting it, or like your parents like kind of hinted you were gonna get a PS one? <laughs> got got an accidental got one on my 18th birthday when I was Hannah and I were nice. dating. She uh, we we were sitting in my car and she gave me a, you know it was clearly a CD in there and it was the uh, the movie snatch it's one of my favorite movies it was the okay. soundtrack to it and she got it from uh, circuit city at the time when it was yeah, out there yeah circuit city yeah, shout circuit out city. and so i'm like she's like well pop it open let's listen, listen to it and i pop like i get the wrapping off of it and everything and i pop it open there's just no cd and i'm like what uh, and she grabbed it she's like what <laughs> like, oh no so mad. there just wasn't a cd in it when i took it back they're yep. like yeah this happens actually I more than say, you think and i'm like Really? Right. That happens all the time at Circuit City, for sure. Yeah. So I kind of had an Still accidental love Circuit one, City, too. Yeah. yeah. I had an accidental one, too, and it was totally my fault. So this was when I was, like, 12 or 13 or whatever, like, right around that age. And I was still skating at the time. Yeah. And all I asked for was, like, this certain deck and, like, these trucks and, like, these wheels. And that was about the budget. Yeah. So I was like, all right, I'm getting all this stuff, like whatever. And uh, so there's presents under the tree or whatever. On Christmas Eve, you could open one present. Oh, okay. Um, any one you want, but you can only get one. And That's I, how we do it at our house. I picked the gift bag kind of thing because I was like, in my eyes, if you got trucks. Oh, then you definitely got the rest. Well, it well that too. But if you got trucks, it's not going to be in either of these boxes. Gotcha. And I'm like, no, nah, there's no way, right? And so I'm like, these are fucking trucks. Like this whole time, like yeah. psyching myself <laughs> up, and uh, and I open it up. He's and it's, eating dinner over the table, looking at that yeah. present. Those are, those are fucks. Yeah, I'm oh, gonna right. get it. Yeah. Getting that X-ray vision <laughs> and, on, dude. And I open it up, and it's a fucking like bathrobe. <laughs> and I was like. What? Very, was, very was, much not trucks. I was right. thinking Christmas story. Remember when he opens up like his aunt's or whatever, the, yeah. or his grandma's gift? It's always yeah. the fucking onesie PJs. Right. That's what I was thinking it was. Dude, it, yeah, it was a That's fucking funny. bathrobe. And I was like so disappointed. But you did it to yourself. But I did it to myself. <laughs> and I was like chilling in the bathrobe. And I was thinking, like, because <laughs> it was a nice bathroom. It's now yeah, my thinking real. robe. 13-year-old on Christmas Eve <laughs> just fucking <laughs> melted into the couch <laughs> in my <laughs> new <laughs> bathroom. <laughs> and, uh, <laughs> but in my head, I was, like, thinking about it. And I'm like, I'm an idiot 
Because I would like you could like pick up the bag or whatever. Yeah, yeah. Before you open it to see right. which one you want. And that one had no weight. Yeah, exactly. It had no weight. <laughs> and but I in was your like, mind, you're still like, yeah. it's got to be trucks. I was like, there's no way that was trucks because it was so light. I'm like, I'm an idiot. So in your eyes, were you thinking that that's all you got was your deck, your bo- your yeah. wheels, and your, your trucks? Right. That's all I thought I was getting. And then nice. I got a bathrobe, and then I was like, that fucks up the budget. Yeah. Like, well, that they, means, uh, that wait, means at least what do the- I not get? Oh, no. <laughs> oh, my yeah. God. So now depression's hitting it at yeah. an all-time yeah, high. Dude. Like, oh, God, did I get anything it? else? I got it all. Tech, I got the bathroom. You got it tech neck style. And, <laughs> no, in the box, they put the deck and the trucks uh, in the same okay. box. And then I got wheels and stuff, too. Probably because they knew these would be a bitch yeah. to wrap. And they were like, yeah. after I opened that in the morning, they were like, we felt Why so bad. Yeah. Like this whole time you were like, I'm going to get that one. And we're like, please don't get that one. Like, that's good. No, like, are you don't. sure you want that one? Right. So yeah, I did it to oh, myself. Oh man. That's but fun. I will that's never, a great story. I will never forget it. I'll never forget it. That's hilarious. Oh man. Caden kind of did that this year though. Yeah. He, uh, he was like, I'm going to get the biggest, biggest gift for Christmas Eve. I'm going to unwrap the biggest gift. And we're like, all right. Right. So he wanted, like, all these fighting Halo people, right? Like, he loves his Halo stuff. So he opens it up, and it's, like, uh, an easel thing for his art, because he's always drawing and stuff. Right. <laughs> and so he was like, uh. <laughs> and I was like, buddy, like, it's not fighting, but you can draw fighting on it. Right. <laughs> so, Jeez. I mean, he, he uses it, which is cool, but he was like, oh. Uh, Right. I wanted fighting toys. Yeah. Right. Like, yeah, you wanted the biggest gift. Sometimes the biggest one ain't always the best one. Right. It's very true. Shit. Oh, man. Craziness. So, but yeah, that's funny. I don't think I had... I, I never tried to fake out the kids. Never I tried to... do that, man. No. I don't think my parents ever did anything like that to me that I can remember. Yeah. And that's the thing. I don't think I would ever fake out. I think I would do some, like... Funny shit like you did, like right. with a gift card. Like, Make them I would work do like, a little extra. I, I like, I mean, like there's the, been several times where I've given gifts where it's like they, it's a small gift, but there's a big box and then a small. That's box what I'm saying. I would be box like the box smaller. within the box within yeah. the box so, type shit. Like dude, that shit's funny. One year, dude, when I was like probably six or seven, I got a big ass toy chest, nice. like a big black, like probably fake leather or whatever toy mm-hmm. chest, and it was saran wrapped and like wrapped in duct tape too. And they were like, open it up. So I'm digging through all this shit. And then I open it up after forever. <laughs> <laughs> and uh, there's, a, there's a hundred one dollar bills in there. Whoa. And I was like, whoa. You're rich. Yeah. The richest kid ever. I was, like, man. I was like six or seven. And then I took that hundred dollars and I went to Circuit City. Swear Shout to God. Shout out to Circuit City again. Shout out Circuit City again. Got an empty CD case. <laughs> <laughs> right. <laughs> No, uh, sir. <laughs> this DVD case is supposed to have both Wayne Wor- Wayne's Worlds in it, and it right. doesn't have either. And it totally has Bill and Ted's on. Excellent Adventure. <laughs> <laughs> Somebody switched them, which is fine. It's a great movie. It's just not what I was wanted to pay for. I was very upset. Right. <laughs> I'll keep it, but that shit's hilarious. Um, yeah, I don't even know what I was saying now. You I'm, were you went to Circuit City, which with oh, and I bought I bought my first boombox. Oh, dude, and a Baja Men CD. That's the first CD I ever oh, you bought. Let, you so let the you dogs were, out. <laughs> yeah, dude. Like, woo, woo. Let them out, let son. Him, that's what I'm talking about. Alert the authorities. It was it was it was Adam the whole Adam. time. Adam dude. let him out. Fucking and then I got my little Bow Wow CD that oh, we talked about. Oh shoot, so yeah. Dude. Just so you what did Great you have times. A, did you have a backpack and stuff? Kick flipping backboard and rails? Uh no, Chad not yet. Musking it. That not one. yet. Not yet. <laughs> oh man. Chad Musketing it. <laughs> <laughs> Chad I was, Musk was known. He was known for. Did you Did you see the? I uh, played with him on Tony Hawk. Yeah. Yeah, the, yeah. Did you see the Halloween Hill Bomb where that guy was dressed as Chad Muskin and he had uh-uh. the boombox? He was uh-uh. skating the whole the bomb in that hill with the boombox. That's box. awesome. He ate shit so many dude, times. Dude, I yeah, I <laughs> will not. Dude, I will not watch people bomb hills. We're go. We're going to that one year. Are you kidding me? Oh, we're going dude. to San Francisco to watch the Halloween Hill Bomb, man. Halloween dude, Hell Bomb. I think they that's call it. that's one of the most anxiety ridden things. Speaking Hey, let's let's pre- yeah, dude. Hey, let's pretend they fucked me up so many times. I even refuse to watch anybody. Yeah, because I have a heart attack anytime their feet like go like this. Yeah, and I'm like, oh, no, no. 
It's, hey, let's pretend uh, that there's yeah. somebody in this room that doesn't skate just for some odd okay. reason. Yeah, damn. I, that's right. probably, that's one of my things that I want to do this and year. And explain to somebody what this uh, <laughs> thing in San Fran is. Oh, okay, so um, Thrasher is based out <laughs> of San Francisco, and yep. they had to do this thing called the Halloween Hellbox. You could have anything. You don't have to have a skateboard. You could be on rollerblades, on a bike. You could be in a bathtub that's on wheels. And yep. they go Dope. down this giant hill, and you do not look out for anybody you go as fast as you can. Like that that's the whole thing. If anybody's going slow, they will run into you on purpose. Right. They I mean, you're going as fast as you can. And then they bring out a, a kicker, uh, which is a ramp, just a kind of a yep. it's got transition on it. So it's kind of a curved ramp, not a flat yeah. ramp. And they see how high and how far they can go. They're going insanely fast. And they're going way too high. And there's on, always on very shitty equipment. Very. <laughs> and there's there's always broken arms and legs yeah. and it's insane and somebody always wins the Halloween hell bomb somehow oh, yeah. I think it has to do with who you dressed up as and there was that guy who was he launched over like standing people holding signs in the air and he's launching over them just to flat ground. I was about to say, so what do they land on? Just the their ground, face. And you keep going down the hill. And their arms. Yeah. Holy shit. And your ankles. Like, it's it's a cardinal sin in skateboarding. Like, if you're doing a trick somewhere where there's a hill, if you go off an edge and you're going to the hill, if you don't do the whole hill, it's like, doesn't count. Yeah. There's yeah. a lot of, like, little minutia in that. Shit. I hate that shit. I well, you hate it. <laughs> I hate it, dude. I'm, uh, this year, I really that want us shit. to sit here and do, like, a couple skateboarding episodes. Okay, we can Even we if can it's do just that. For Patreon stuff, or yeah, whatever. we can but definitely I, I do that. I want to talk skateboarding for a lot. sure. Yeah, <laughs> dude, I'm down. That's all I've been watching lately. Same. I think I said that yesterday when we were hanging out because we usually just watch shit on YouTube or whatever. Yeah. And I was like, I don't even know what I've been watching lately. Like just skateboarding and UFC shit. Yep. That's yep. all I've been watching. Did the Burt cast with Tony and Ellis was yep. the best. Yep. Because they went great. they went there straight after skating the. Um, uh, the pink Ellis mo- died. The, yeah, the pink motel pool with Lance Mountain. Yep. And he Lance. Ate, he <laughs> yeah, another Lance. Lance. Fucking Lance all over the place. <laughs> but he when he ate it and he's sitting there, he's trying not to laugh and he's just holding his ribs the whole day. I felt so bad for him. Right. Oh man. It's a great episode. All these yeah. Lances in here, they be balling. <laughs> Dude, this episode has been insane. I have no idea what's going on. All over the place. Uh, what's up, guys? Welcome to the Everyday <laughs> Podcast. We are doing ads right now, and uh, I just wanted to catch Baker looking like a unicorn. So Love how you did the actual intro for the ads. <laughs> it is what so it is. So thank you for the advertisement segment. Yes, thank you, guys. Uh, if you want to see Baker as a unicorn, check out the video. Uh, but we wanted to shout out our <laughs> Patreon producers. That is Taylor, Tom, Patty Light, Barilli. Joel, Sarah, Steve, Anthony, Jeremiah, Twitch.tv slash Evil Tony, and the Teachers Every Podcast. <laughs> Woo! <Yeah>. Whoa. <laughs> we appreciate you Got guys. Got excited. We couldn't do this without you. Yes, uh, thank you. Sign up, please. The link and the website is going to be right here when I edit that in, and it's going to be really cool and really orange, and it's going to be right here. You'll so be able click to it. see it. Click it, click but it, click it. only if you're on YouTube, because you won't be able to see it if you're only listening on audio, because so you hashtag can't watch see it. the video. Hashtag watch the video. Uh, but we appreciate all you guys. Tell them what else. <laughs> <laughs> we got Baru Bagar Photography <laughs> coming in with our A1 since day one. Sponsors. Choo. 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 They some true island boys. <laughs> I had to put it in there. You, you got to do it. Oh, yes. But you can find them at facebook.com slash Brewbaker Photography with the number one there at the end. Oh, no. Again, check them out. Support your local business. Hit on that community tab. Share their page. Ask your friends. Invite them to it. Like, subscribe, and check out their pictures. Island boy out. <laughs> <laughs> and, uh, yeah, shout out Brewbaker Photography. And we got to shout out the man himself. Who that? Mr. Nate Collins. <laughs> Some people call him Mike Jones. Not really. Uh, but go down to Spencer on 4th Street in Mansfield. Hit up Nate. Uh, if you need a new or used vehicle, he will work with you on any credit as well. Any. And he's going to hook you guys up with some deals for the holidays. Yo, what are those deals? So one of them is pretty cool. If you get a vehicle off of him, you get free car washes for the life of the vehicle. Make it look fresh and squeaky clean. <laughs> I love it. 
And then uh, also, if you don't need a vehicle, but you know somebody who does, oh, yeah? let them know about Nate down well, in Spitzer on Mansfield. Because if you recommend somebody to him yeah. and they end up getting a car, he will personally send you a hundred dollars. Woo is not a president. <laughs> not Benny Frank. Not a Benny not Frank. Not Benny Frank. But you still get a Benny Frank. <laughs> In your pocket. Uh-huh. So hit up Nate. Uh, like I said, go down to Spitzer on on 4th Street in Mansfield. Call or text him, 419-961-4581. That's right. Do it now. Right now. Go. Now. Turn off the episode. Text him. Pause it. Call him. We'll be here. Do it. Bye. Back to the action. Yeah. Peace. Bye. Okay. Cut. But it's okay. Shouts out. Shouts out. Shouts out. Because he's shouts doing out. He's doing all the math. Shouts out Betty White. Kind of looks like that. A little bit. Oh my uh, god. Anyway, it was, anyway, it was pretty. <laughs> no, I, I meant that in a positive way. I can't believe that shit, man. Yeah. And we were just, me and Danielle were just talking about her. I was like, damn, she's still kicking. Right. Yeah. And then get that shit today. Right. Dude, so I posted on Facebook. I was like, <laughs> this is what I, I saw said. It, yeah. I'm an idiot, but <laughs> yeah. I was like, you know how shitty the bookkeeping was in nineteen twenty one? And I was like, I guarantee they just didn't write Betty White's birthday down correctly, and they got it wrong. So she actually is 100 years old, and she knew it. And I was like, that's why she went out like that. Yeah, you're out of it, man. No. <laughs> somebody said, nah. Somebody said, check this out. I don't know if the math adds up, but it sounds good. So somebody said oh my she God. lived through 24 different, um, what's the... So, ah, uh, fuck, leap years. Oh, she lived through twenty four leap years. Mm-hmm. So, if you actually calculate that into her 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 days lived, uh, it it adds twenty four to it, and she would have been a hundred. So she's actually been alive. That's oh. a stretch. Nah, man. <laughs> nope, it works. <laughs> it works, dude. It's still a year. Yeah, no, 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 like until her birth. I know what he's talking yeah, about. Yeah, I know what he's talking about, too. I don't know. Whatever. I'm just saying. She's a gangster. We're, we're backing him into a corner. He's, yeah, don't do this. Upset. Well, now don't people, if that's, if that's the case and the math adds up, yeah. now people are going to say that she was part of the fucking Illuminati. Might have been, dude. I'm just saying that's where that shit's going to go. That's why they called her queen, dog. Lance is a part of the Illuminati. Ooh. Oh! <laughs> what is going on? <laughs> <laughs> know, you started it. I don't know. Did I start it? As I long as it. that term was singular. Yeah. <laughs> dude. What? I don't want to talk about... Where's your car? It's outside. What are you talking about? I don't know. You said dude. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> Such a good movie. Don't encourage me. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you for saying hey, that. You're welcome. I knew it was going to come eventually. What is going on? Don't encourage me, but encourage me. All right. Oh. Come on. How long have we been recording? I have no uh, idea. How many uh, fucking questions are you going to ask today? 36 minutes. All right. All right. Cut it short. New Year's. Got to go. All right. Bye. <laughs> bye. No. What else we got? Family. I don't know. Laser eyes. Laser eyes. <laughs> yeah. Fucking Cyclops. Uh, I was yeah. talking to Adam a little bit on how, like, the procedure for uh, LASIK goes, because I got LASIK back in 2019. Because my eyes suck. Yeah. Yeah, they we do. We were just talking about all Shut that. Up, but it's dude. Like, 2020, I, what? I wish I'd have done it sooner. It was worth every penny. I yeah, but I don't you. want a laser in my fucking eye, dude. Well, it's not. I mean, like, that's that's what we were talking about. I'm talking that, about, like, uh, like Tom Cruise laser. laser. It's better than laser. And, ooh, fuck yeah, that it looks like, zzz, like. It's better yeah, than lasers coming out of your it, eye. Well, I mean, I don't. It's not like red, like a laser. I don't think. Okay. I think it's like a, it's like white, if anything, like clear. Cause I don't know if that's scarier it's really, or not. It's really like a microscopic needle that comes down. And it's like, shh. Yeah, I don't want to sh- fucking hear that shit. No, no it's dude. It's like scraping so, it like a fucking chalkboard, bro. So what you do is, is um, you go like they tell you when to show. Up, they're like, wear comfy clothes and show up, you know. And you, they give you a couple pills to take before you get there. So you're kind of loopy sitting in the, my dad dropped me off and, you know, you're just kind of sitting there and you're a little, oh, kind of, you're just kind of chill from the pills. They take you to the back 
where they give you, I think they gave me like another two pills or something. They, they gave me some more uh, sedatives basically yeah. to chill you out. And then you're super I don't like chill. This already. And they <laughs> keep and coming tripping. in every so often and just di- like dilate. They have to dilate your eyes like a lot. Right. So they keep dilating your eyes. Um, and Doesn't was, that mean make nervous. the people bigger? This sounds bigger. like yeah. my worst nightmare Not already, really. dude. But I mean, everybody was super chill, and it was. I mean, they they talk you through it the whole time. It wasn't no bad experience, dude. But so you you get the dial, and they're like, okay, now you need to come in this room. So they kind of like they have to like help you up, and they take you over to the the next room where the laser is. And it's a giant machine, right? And then so basically, you <laughs> lay on this <laughs> the table, laser. and then the doctor <laughs> comes in, Austin and he has Powers. to like move you underneath the laser on the one side. And what they do is he cuts open. Um, I don't remember all the parts of the eye, but the top of your eye, the, the outermost part, cuts that, and they have to peel it back. And well, before that, they tape your eye open too. How is this a convincing argument to do <laughs> this? Why does this look like a fucking? I'm just telling this you is what a, happens. This is a saw movie, dude. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. They, Why does it seem like torture? Tape it, they tape that okay. shit back. They tape it so you can't like blink on the laser and like burn your freaking eyelid or whatever. So they do that. They cut that, they move it back, and then they, you know, they're telling you the whole time. They're oh like, hey, this is what's twitched. happening. <laughs> and they're like, okay, so now hey, the laser's going to start. And Dude, so no. you hear, it sounds like, um, um, sounds like a lightsaber. Yeah, oh, you know what it sounds like? It sounds like when you like buzz somebody into a building. Yeah, like, no, I don't like that. Me, me, me. Why? And it no. keeps making that noise. And then, like, <laughs> I can't describe it. Like, only other people who have had this. I bet anybody out there who's had LASIK, you know the smell of burning eyeball, and it's weird. What the fuck? You you can smell your eyeballs burning. God damn. So they do that, and they have to be super careful. It's like a clean room because Let while your out. eyes open, while your eyes open, Let you out, can't buddy. get any dust or anything in there. And so here's what happens. So on my right eye, took a little longer to heal because of this. So they they did that, moved me out of the way, prepped everything else, moved me back over for my left eye, did the same thing. And they're, no. they're like wetting your eye That's this only whole one time, eye. too. No. Uh-uh. And again, they, they burn your eyeball. And there's yes, no fucking thing in that. And then once no you have to out. lay there for a bit, um, like eyes open as they're doing drops, because they have to keep checking to make sure everything's okay. And that when yeah, you they're when making sure they cut, didn't fucking back, burn through to your brain, <laughs> they dude. Don't. They got to check they that. They don't. Oh, my God. So they had to flush my right eye. They're like, they, yeah, I think there's something they're, in there. So they had to flush my right eye. There was a complication? A slight complication, but it wasn't bad. So, but here's here's the payoff. Here's the payoff. So they take me back. I know. The payoff, no, time out. The payoff is you don't have to put on glasses every day. No, not at all. I would rather just no, you put on glasses every Adam, day. Adam, you've had them on for so long. You, you wouldn't you have want no to. idea how freeing it was. Dude, I've only had you glasses no for like three times. years. Oh, And I've you hate mine. the I've shit had, out of them. What? I, I remember when I got mine in 1991 because right after I got Ooh, it, we went, we went and saw the Ninja Turtle movie in the theater. That's I different. Just, I was Michael. just a Dude, baby. I got mine when I was 27. Okay, no, I've had I had yeah. them since I was like five or six or something. Okay, well that's different. I'm still like, so, yeah, it's whatever. It, um, He's still a newbie to this shit. Yeah, in the uh, the other room, and they kind of just make sure everything's okay, and then they check you a couple more times when everything's good. They they wheeled me to the front. My dad was there. He took me. I was just. I was hungry and I was sorry because you had to like fast and stuff too. I was hungry and I just, like, everything was so bright and I couldn't really open my eyes. So time out. Everything you've said so far is bad. It, it was, like, it was like uncomfortable. None of this is good. My eyes didn't hurt. I okay. mean, I was so sedated okay. and everything, nothing hurt. I was just really tired. I remember being hungry and my dad's like, here, I'll drive through McDonald's. I'll get you a double cheeseburger. You can go home and rest. I'm like, perfect. So I got that. He took me home. I like, I ate it in the car on the way home and I like couldn't open my eyes. It was really weird. So, I mean, I could, but it just, it would hurt. Wait, so, but it, you just said it didn't hurt. Well, I mean, it just, Afterwards. The, the brightness was was really rough to deal with right then. So and picture yourself as Neo in the Matrix. Remember when he got, <laughs> yeah, when he got up, pulled out? When he got pulled out? Yeah. Kind of like that. Um, so oh, then, yeah, you're like that. But here, here's the, the new world. best part of the whole thing, okay? Oh, my God. I go home. This is like 10 in the morning, all right? I go home. I, I eat. I get in bed. I fall asleep. I wake up like six and a half or seven hours later, right? Because I was just super tired. And I open my eyes and I can see. I could just oh, I can see. see. Like, perfect. A whole new I mean, it was still a little world. blurry because I had to keep like using eye drops for a little while. It was a little blurry, but I mean, I could see. 
So okay, it, let it was me unbelievable to me. Let me put this in perspective. This is how much And after it, that I felt fine. Like even the next okay. day they, they said I I took a few days off to to like I'm like oh, okay, I might need to recover or whatever. No, like the next day I was supposed to go to um a Toro meeting where we were checking new lawnmowers and all that stuff. And I'm like, let's screw it. I'm going to the meeting. I, I'm fine. I felt fine. I was perfect. Right. I took the kids to school and I'm just like, screw it. I'm going to the meeting. And because I felt great. Yeah. So this is how much of my nightmare this is. Okay. You ready? <laughs> I have never even used eye drops in my life because I don't want anything touching my eyes ever. Oh, it'd be, you know, it'd be a good episode is if I got Jared, my buddy Jared on here, because he, Ugh. he had to get yeah. an experimental eye surgery. And while they were doing it, his eye deflated. Stop it. Yeah. It's a great that story. That sounds horrible. Stop that. <laughs> That's, uh. But yeah, LASIK was amazing. And the Ohio sounds, eye place was awesome. I don't it, know. It sounds like a fucking nightmare, uh, dude. It was, yeah, it was weird, but literally that. That whole thing from me telling you beginning to end when I showed up and when I left was like maybe an hour. When I the whole laser part, both yeah, eyes, you, maybe 10 minutes, and that was only because I had to flush my right eye again. But you talked about crazy noises, which I hate. <laughs> you talked about burning eye smell. Yeah. yeah. You talked about flushing your you, eye. You cutting your eye. You want a worse one? I can tell you my story. No, no. I can no, tell no, you my no. story about my vasectomy. No, <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> fuck that noise. Patreon. Uh-uh. Uh, you, <laughs> can, you can record com. that Patreon. I'm calling yeah. in sick that day. <laughs> Patreon.com slash Podcast. Nope. <laughs> no not guarantees, happening. but sign up anyway. <laughs> Man. Happy 2022. 20, uh. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Well played. You made it through. I mean, I'm telling you, it was 100% worth it. Just because I... But the one thing that, that happens... Every so often now, but like all the time when I was, um, when I first got it done, I remember like one of my kids crying in the middle of the night once and like they were crying. I got up and I'm like, where the hell are my glasses? And I'm like, they must've fallen off the nightstand. And I'm like crawling under my bed. I'm like, where the hell are my glasses? And my wife gets up. She's like, what the hell are you doing? And I just stood up and I'm like, I'm an idiot. And I just had walked yeah. into their room. <laughs> like they're crying. And I'm just like looking like, I need my glasses. My kid's crying. You're like, oh shit, I don't have glasses anymore. I right. don't need them. Dude, I would never do that. I <laughs> would I never always, do like, that. You'd, you'd go to like, like take your glasses off at night. And I would poke myself. And I'm like, oh, damn it. Ow. Because <laughs> you don't have glasses, but you're so used to right. taking them off. See, not me. Not used to that. Yeah. Wouldn't Wild. Do it. Since 1991. Yeah, that's a long fucking time. Mm-hmm. Yep. So you'd never do contacts then? No. Nope. Never. Ever. Yeah, it was seven or eight. Good times. I did contacts there for a while when I was in high school. When I was cool. A couple pictures I posted on <laughs> Teacher Dummy is when I had contacts. Yeah. I'd be wearing the did, dope uh, ass colored contacts. Did you have a current event some. for today? Other I than. Had, I had one current event. Other than B Dog? to go. I had something else I wanted to okay. go over. Oh, I. You hold here. Hang on. Let me bring you. See, he said one thing. It sounded weird. What? One thing. Two things. One thing. Yeah, you got to have two things. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, you got to have, yeah, have, thing. have two things. Gosh. Yeah, but two real things, motherfucker. Where the heck How are you trying to still say mine was fake? Messenger. All the way on the left, bro. Uh, you I'm hit the idiot. one that says Holy messenger fuck, right there. Chill, bro. Chill, bro. Chill, chill. Oh, shit. Chill, chill. Flavor, flavor. Chill, chill. Oh, here I sent it. The time is now. Uh oh. Right, oh, is this the tongue uh, thing? You got me. Yeah, oh, that's dope. Cool. Why did so you fucking you read it? I've already. You... Huh? No, I've already huh? Just saw this what? before. Why are you ruining you gotta... everybody's shit today? <laughs> oh, I will fuck you up. Why sir? are you ruining everybody's Dude, shit? Dude, I don't know what you're talking about. Oh, yeah, let's see. You, my lamps how do you joke. Open it in Safari again. I, I think remember. you got to hold it down. Okay. And yeah, and then and then you hit open in Safari. I was holding down on the wrong spot. Yeah, Doug. All right, what we got? All right, fish found with parasite that eats tongue and then becomes its tongue. Yeah, I read dude. this a while back, but I I just thought it was the what? most interesting yeah. thing. Yeah, yeah I saw this like last week, but this is yeah, nuts. it's a par- it's a parasite that like gets into a fish's mouth and literally eats its tongue and then sits there and eats all the food that comes to it, so the fish doesn't get any nourishment. But the parasite lives off of the food that it's the fish would have eaten, and then the the fish eventually just dies because it can't eat or <laughs> right survive <laughs> dude what that's like yeah. some alien shit dude the ocean is so fucked up yeah 
Oh the my parasite god! Then survives in the fish's mouth by feeding on the host animal's mucus. Uh, the only known example of the parasite replacing an organ of its host. So it's a smart ass parasite. Right. right. Yep. So it's saying, I'm going to fucking, you're going to eat me, and yeah. I'm going to latch to your tongue. Looks I'm going like to eat your tongue. That's the down in its mouth. Like, the first oh, one I read, dude. when they found it, they didn't have, like, a picture that like shit. this. That shit's crazy. Oh, crazy looking, ain't it? I saw one with, like, the parasite being head on. Oh, so mm. nasty. Look at that parasite. <laughs> on the bottom right. <laughs> oh, that's great. We'll I, keep that off that episode, I got but it. that's hilarious. I like that, son. All right, so the only other thing I had is... That's nuts. Jaboy listened to last week's episode and have a couple questions for you. Uh Oh, Oh, shit. (laughs) Wait, so you're questioning us about last week's episode. Yeah. Okay. Yes, he is. Couple Damn. questions. Well, there's there's a couple just random uh, fact checks in here as well. <laughs> I'm um, sure, dude. I bet. <laughs> don't ever listen to us. We don't tell the truth ever. You just don't know what you're talking about. So exactly, <laughs> these, these are. You just uh, don't know what you're talking about. I fully believe that. <laughs> um, Let me get my skittles out. I'm just gonna. Yeah, oh my god. I'm just gonna. I'm gonna, I'm gonna put these out there, and you guys can just answer. Oh, We're no. not gonna put you against each other or anything. But I just oh, wanted no. to. I wanted you guys to kind of see and hear this. So fuck. Well, teamwork. Um, we'll start with the first one, as in, so you guys <laughs> argued back and forth a little like bit. I feel like we're on trial. <laughs> <laughs> you argued back and forth I a little bit last fifth. week about the the lady with the cat, if it was a stuffed cat, or okay. if it was a um, a dead cat. Right, yeah, right, right whatever right. that is. Yeah. Right. And what is that called? So I want to ask like a you. Taxiderm. What? What's it? At, what's yeah? What's it Taxidermia? actually called? Taxidermia? Yeah, it's like a taxidermy. <laughs> I don't know. Taxidermy. Whatever. Taxidermy is the art form. Yeah. 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 yeah you, got, you got it. That's, that's okay. right. I just wanted to know if you actually, you guys actually knew that. So you're good. Yeah, dude. It's not taxidermia. But it's, I don't know it's what it is. <laughs> okay, there we go. That's, there's actually... um. We're just adding shit. Look, to that's like... Yeah, it. that's just a fancy way of saying it, dude. <laughs> we were just adding an A for effort. Yeah, you there's know. There's a guy who came into plus, the, <laughs> the hardware store all the time. Who was getting lye? Got tons of lye, uh, like the because it's cheaper to get it as like a bathroom like, for you know, like drains and stuff. But he did that for because he was a taxidermist, so he okay. used that to like tan hides. And do okay, all that stuff too, uh, so hmm. pretty interesting. Okay. <laughs> you're, you're, you're gonna throw up after this episode. Yeah, aren't dude, you? Why is this? That's um, bad. Right. Oh, I didn't write that one down. Oh well. So let's go with let's go with the first one. Who in last week's episode? Had the most swears, dude. I don't Probably know. man. I have a fucking sailor's mouth, dude. You did that one on purpose. <laughs> <laughs> I would say me, dude. I think we both like. We both think we're equal degenerates. Yeah, you know. <laughs> I'm just counting them up. I'm sorry. You got just numbers? Sure. Oh, He's I got got some numbers. Math. oh, I counted them. Oh, God. And I'm sure I missed a few because I was trying to like do this while I'm doing other things. Man. All right. So <clears throat> let's let's start with uh, how many do you think you had? A swears all together. Yeah, Ryan Baker, how many swear words did you say? And I count the ones I don't count are damn or ass. I don't count those, but damn I count everything ass. else. I feel like those two I don't say that much. I say those all the time, dude. I know you do. <laughs> yeah, I don't count those as much. Um, let's go with 100. <laughs> For you? That's what he's saying, yeah. What do you, what do you got? 100. For you. you know, just go with flat 100. Okay. Yeah. okay. Am I doing for me? Matt, uh, yeah, Adam, do do for you. Uh, sh- I mean, I'd probably go high 80s. <laughs> <laughs> He okay. said 87. Dude, that's what I was going to say, 87. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Baker Eight. had the most. Yes. Okay, that's good. And uh, he had 115. Wow. <laughs> I'm telling you, dude, I got to. I'm like, Baker, stop it. I that's a bit so do you, do you got I my noticed, number? Yeah, I, I noticed number. it because of the clips that you put on. Yeah. <laughs> I was like, I'm pretty sure I cussed at least like six times just <laughs> in these damn clips. Like. I, yeah, I've got a problem sometimes. Yeah. All right, okay. Adam, you had 31. Oh, son. So if you do cuss son, a lot, you do say I'm damn and ass a lot. I'm a gentleman, bro. 
that, you ain't shit. The other episode I did, you had more. You were in the fifties or something like that. I think. Hey, all right. How many guys? How many do you guys think uh, Tim had? Tim had. Dude, if I one hundred and fifteen. <laughs> Tim, yeah, gosh, <laughs> yeah, that Tim should had, be eye opening. Tim had twenty two. Okay, Baker. Tim had eleven. Yeah, I mean, Tim's a good guy, dude. Six. Yeah. Oh, wow. Yeah, we had six. How much you guess? He's a, what? I said 22. Yeah. Uh, but even 22 is respectable. Six? It'd be Shout cool. out, it Tim. It would have been cool yeah. if you said. Shout out, Tim. What a fucking good guy, dude. <laughs> I know. I got, I got. No, um, I mean, I can't say anything. I got yeah, a couple you, random, like, just questions out there. You did um, 30 times more. Yeah. Or like 25 times more than... That's only because he took out damn an ass. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe. Because then you, you would have been... have had too Then you would have been 200. The no, he wasn't there. <laughs> All right. I would have been in the 200s, so, probably. <laughs> Man. Probably, yeah. I'm going to try not been. to cuss next one. I was... Here was my thought Good for this episode. <laughs> After doing this, I'm like, okay, for this episode, I thought about bringing one of my kids... And what? just having them sit there with me. No. During this. And I'm like, that wouldn't that be the funniest experiment if I just showed up a little bit and say, I'm like, now they have to behave. It would be how, funny to see you try and behave. How old though? Because dude, 11. I was, I was gonna oh, bring the they oldest. can understand a lot. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> dude, I'd suck at it because I've slipped up when people have brought their kids to work. Yeah, and they're like in the like the office office where you know typically like it'd be great because Asher would just be like he said a bad word I'm like yeah I know he did yeah but he would say it every four seconds bro we should get shock collar thingies <laughs> oh, you can have that that's a oh, great idea for you that we should be, do that shit I'm down that would shoot be funny. stuff crap mail it in damn what? it you want a couple uh, just random yeah dude oh okay. my god let's get the pressure off me <laughs> 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 all right who knows. Who knows what uh, scuba stands for? Oh, man, I used to know this. Isn't that like scuba diving? Uh, yes. <laughs> yes, it is, but scuba stands yeah. for scuba something. Steve? It's an acronym. <laughs> it's an acronym. Oh, wait, we lost our music. Swim. And we're back here with random Creepily. knowledge with the uh, Average AF Podcast, boys. Let's let's see if they know this question. <laughs> boys, <laughs> oh, no. what does scuba stand for? Dude, I used to know this, too. <laughs> I got it. I got it. Because I think they said it on, on one of Adam Sandler's movies. Swimming calmly, calmly <laughs> under <laughs> big asses. <laughs> wow. <laughs> that is a, a scuba. A, that is incorrect. <laughs> That's a fun type of scuba, though. <laughs> um, <laughs> um, yeah, I don't know. I'm... It is self-contained underwater breathing apparatus. Yep. Okay. Scuba, Did dude. You kn- scuba. Okay, boys. What does tuba stand for? Tuba? The yeah. instrument tuba? Yeah. It actually stands for something? Mm-hmm. Oh, shoot. I have no Did idea. Did you know that? No, dude. Uh, let's see. I was in band for like seven years. I didn't know that. The ugly big ape. <laughs> I don't know. I fucking saw a gorilla up there. I have no idea. Monkey. That's Harambe, dude. Respect. Tuba stands for terrible underwater breathing apparatus. Oh, that's how you uh, dad jump. It's uh, <laughs> <laughs> fucking punk. Is this how you feel? <laughs> Is this how you feel? He's gonna dance. Oh shit! <laughs> Get it! What God. is happening, dude? That uh, was great. Sorry, I couldn't help myself. I can't believe you. You fucking reeled us and good on that one. We were bamboozled, dude. God, yeah. I hate you, yet I love you so dude. much for that one. You know that, right? You have any more? I, I actually can get a couple more, but that okay. it was really just a setup to knock us oh, down. Oh, man. That was a good one. You know oh, that, you though, that right? That was elaborate, sir. <laughs> I have so much hate and love for you right but now. This is what, but this is what you do to me every week. I know. What kind of... What kind of How's it feel? All right, let me give you... <laughs> what kind of knowledge do you guys think you would... Know? How about Not much. None. <laughs> yeah, question very about little. the 1950s? We can, I mean, as what a li- about, that was a little bit I'll before you, my you time. Choose the category. You okay. guys choose the category. Okay, so you got the 1950s. Oh shit! You've got fancy food. Nope. American dialect and slang. 
It sounds maybe, the best so far. Maybe. Or okay. cold books, cold books and movies. No. Uh, let's do this uh, slang yeah, one. Yeah, for <laughs> sure. Shit. <laughs> here we go. One on here. That's clearly the dumbest category, and we're like, that's the only one we can do. Heard in various parts of the U.S., including some parts of Ohio. Uh, what is the Devil's Ditch? The Devil's Ditch. Music. I'm I don't sorry. know. You have to make that one loop. I know. Devil's <laughs> Ditch. The Devil's Ditch. Time's up, know. gentlemen. What's your answer? You're working together on this one. Yeah, I got it. I've never heard of it. We'll never be able to answer any of these, but we'll I got try. this one wrong when we did it, but uh, it because I thought it was the median. Like, okay. Like 71 or something. It's actually the strip of grass between the sidewalk and the road. Known as okay. the Devil's Ditch. I had no idea. That's I weird. always heard it as Devil's Strip. I I didn't hear I any of those. I've never heard ditch before. Okay. No what idea. do some people in Milwaukee mean by a bubbler? <laughs> I was thinking <laughs> bong. <laughs> right. A, a bubbler. I'll let you know that's not it. <laughs> yeah. Um. A bubbler. bubbler. Would it be like a tea maker? Like a, a water... Uh, water heater upper? Water I'd say like a uh, kettle. Percolator? Bubbler. That's what a percolator is. You know what that is? That's a type of coffee pot. Type. Yeah, I don't know. Like Maybe like a champagne? I don't know. Like It's a water fountain. Okay. <laughs> yeah. You guys are doing you great. You kind of got it. it, right? A little bit. A little bit. You said water. If I'm in Mississippi <laughs> and I tell you the devil is beating his wife, what do I mean? <laughs> what? You're going to hell? <laughs> the, in Mississippi I'm in Mississippi and I tell you the devil is beating his wife What do I mean? Yo, that shrimp smacking <laughs> <Not good. laughs> It means that the sun is shining and it is raining It's a sun shower What the fuck? <laughs> you guys haven't gotten one yet We uh, will Okay I had zero confidence in us Why at all Why would you times. pick this category? You picked it. You <laughs> said it. What am I getting <laughs> if I am in, if I have a donut in New England with Jimmy's on it? Jimmy's sprinkles. It's got to be sprinkles. Yeah. You got it. Like, hey, hey. Okay. talk shit again. Hey. We'll get one yeah, right. Yeah, son. Boom. That's we know our snacks, son. He <laughs> said, "Let me find the easiest fucking one on this list." No, real the quick. easiest one is this one. If a person is described as the goat, what are they? Greatest of all time, there bro. You go. Boom. Um, down south they say y'all. Up north they say you guys. But in what city do they say yins? City. Yins? Chinatown. Philadelphia. It is Pittsburgh. <laughs> ah, dude, I knew it was one of those. Yins? In beatnik talk, T <laughs> is slang for what? Wait, where's T-E-A. this? Where's this at? Like gossip? Is that like the news Spill the tea? for the tea? Gossip? It's marijuana. Uh, maybe smoking <laughs> on some dirt. <laughs> yeah, if it's some... mischief night in New Jersey, what date is it? I don't know, dude. <laughs> 9-11? <laughs> no, dude. Oh, no. Oh, no, that was no, bad. No. That's... I know. I, that was a bad I one. Know. I don't know. That's, uh, I thought you guys The day before one. Halloween. I don't know. You're right. Ah, no way. I mean, you would have had to set October 30th, but. That's the right. day before Halloween. Yeah, you're right. You're good. What up, sign? I wouldn't have known that. That's the super mischief time. All right, I'll give you one more. In Michigan, what are youpers? Cops. Uh, youpers. Dude, I ain't got nothing. That's people from the Upper Peninsula. Ah. <laughs> Yo, Uber. Ubers. Yeah, thanks for playing this game and for me to do a stupid dad joke on them. Ah, yeah. You guys. Ooh, yeah, there it is. Good night. Woo. <laughs> Whoa, dude. Gang, gang, Sean. This has been an interesting-ass episode. I love it. We're probably close to an hour, right? Uh, Yeah, we're, we just hit an hour. Sweet. Nailed it. Damn, Word. dude. That was crazy. What the <laughs> fuck just happened for this hour? Um, 
I cuss a lot. Tune in next time. Yeah, that you I'm do, here. dude. I'm a saint. And we both suck at trivia. <laughs> and uh, Tim is God. Tim had a no. great dad joke that I'm still mad about. Yep. I told a real story to fuck your story up. You did, too. That would piss me <laughs> off. Uh, Two weeks in a row, you fucked me up, Adam. Wow. Yeah, good, dude. Be better, son. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> well, then. Thank you guys for watching. Uh, subscribe, like, share, all that fun stuff. Patreon. And until next week, peace.